That's sexy as hell right there. What's going on, everybody? Welcome back to the channel. I'm Trey with Ghost Tactical. We're here at Trigon 2023 here in beautiful Wichita, Kansas. It's Wichita. We'll go with that. Uh, we're here with we're here with John at Radical Defense, and they've got a lot of really cool products coming out. They got some suppressors. They got a new line of rifles. So, John, maybe let's start with the suppressors and tell everybody what you guys are doing with these. Yeah. So these are our 3D printed DMLS. Uh, suppressors they come in Hanes or titanium they feature our breathable technology so they're a low back pressure can with our guard baffle design we actually use a hollow tube on the inside that breathes and flows the can the air through the can and it vents out the front so with these design in mind with our threading system they actually tighten themselves as you shoot them so you're not going to have your issues of cans coming loose and shooting across the across the range what all calibers that do you have them available for? So we have 5.56 and 30 cal. We have another can in, in process that's going to be 30.38. Nice. All our cans are hub compatible. So if you're in any kind of other system, you don't have to change the muzzle device to run ours. You can actually put a chemo, you can put ASR, whatever system you have already, you can throw it on there. That's we awesome. have long and short cans. They run the same amount of volume, just depending on the system that you, you're running on. If you have a short gun, you want to use a longer can. If you have a long gun, you want to use a shorter can. Absolutely. And I know you guys have sold an enormous amount of rifles this year. It's been a great year for you guys, but you're introducing a new line uh, to the, the public. And it's, it's not the radical that everyone has known them for the last few years. It's a whole new line. Uh, you want to talk a little bit about what you got going on with the rifles? Yes, sir. So we started doing what our sister company is called is Radical Defense. So we actually started doing a more premium shooter oriented brand. So it's for, it's everything's designed with LE and, long, LE and military in mind. Mm. So it's more robust than our standard rifle. We'll actually come on this one last. That's the most going on with it. At PDW Suite, right? That is, this is so bad, so, so bad. So starting off here, we did our 12.5 Mark I carbine. It comes with our thermal fitted handguard onto the barrel nut, so you're not going to lose alignment. And our handguards have an alignment tab that go from the handguard to the upper receiver, so it's never going to shift on you. It lowers the amount of deflection. With our crossbar safety, our crossbar mounting system, you're never going to break this thing off. And that alignment tab, we brought it into our gas block. Now, from here, it looks like the gas block's a little bit different than the other ones as well. Yeah, so the gas block itself is taller and threaded. So with that being used, we actually use a straight gas tube. Nice. So you don't have the parasitic bleed of gases out of that area. Absolutely. And the alignment tab that's built into the gas block lines it to a notch in the barrel to keep it straight. So it's not going to move either. It's not going to move. Everything's, everything's stable. Um, yeah, it's pretty great. This is with the 12 and a half model here. Yes, sir. And then we actually made all our barrels to have a little bit different gas systems than standard. So this is a carbine plus one. Our nice. 14.5 has a mid length, and then our 16 inch are all intermediate. And awesome. with that being said, our gas ports are actually smaller because of our gas sealing system, mm -hmm. and it has really low recoil, unsuppressed and suppressed. This is, uh, I was messed with this yesterday, and the great thing I love about this is the weight. You put a lot of girth into it to make sure it's stable, but yet it's not gonna be overpowering and, 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 and be too heavy for a lot of people. Uh, great length, great feel, everything that's nice, nice. Like you said, it's not its not going to be destroyed. You're not going to hurt this bad boy at oh, all. No. And actually, as you see, these are all our actual our range guns. Yeah. So we didn't bring like a show queen to the show. Right. You know, this is you, the ones that have been, been shot. Used. Yeah. Hey, if you look at some of these cans, like the Cerakote's got like, changing colors on it because we we're, we were at a full auto demo This yesterday. one right here, yeah. 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 yeah, those guys at fifth group were going nuts on that. Nice. PW. Now you got a little DMR gun over here, is that correct? Yes, sir. So this is our 16 inch DMR. It has the same. That's sexy as hell right there. The same mounting system as our other handguards. 
but the main difference on this one, it has a thicker barrel before the gas block and then it tapers down after the gas block. So it's gonna give you really good accuracy and it's gonna last a lifetime. And they also come with a Schmidt two-stage trigger. Oh, nice. And the B5 Precision Stock. Yeah. And this one actually retails for $15.99. Really? Yeah. Oh, wow. Oh, and another standard thing that's across all the oh, lines. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. The Battle Arms Development Rack Charging Handle and the Griffin Armament Sights. So we've talked about the 12 and a half. We've talked about the 16-inch DMR. This little sweetheart is the one that I really want to uh, get some more info about. This is something that's right up my alley, a uh, little CQB, a uh, little personal defense. Let's talk about this bad boy. Yeah, so this is our PDW. It comes in either 5.56 or 300 blackout. It has a six inch barrel with a six and a half inch suppressor. So that's actually set up to be a rip and, rip and grip. So if you pull it pretty hard, it'll actually uh, deploy. There we go. That's the Battle Arms Development PDW stock. It's one of the most robust PDW stocks that we've tested before we released this product and we're super happy with it. The nice thing about this one, we set it as the rip and grip system, but if you wanted to, you can remove the back plate and change it out and it becomes a standard five position stock. Right. And it's real easy, even for me, push that button and you're in. Pull it, you're good to go, push it. Even a Marine can do it, it's Marine proof. But uh, yeah, I love and I love what you guys have done. The little details, the side rails, it's not it's not necessarily quad rail, but you've kind of turned it into a, almost a little yeah, quad rail. And, and that's, that comes with like a feature set. So like if you wanted to do M walk all the way down, the handguard or the sorry, the handguard goes over the suppressor. Yeah. So at that point you can't put M lock here. Yeah. So what are you gonna do? You, it, it kind of screws you. So we decided, well let's put Picatinny on there. And but but it's not the robust, overwhelming quad rail that we all know and love. It's just a few few spots here and there to where you can put whatever your lights or your laser or whatever. It's a quad rail, but it's not a quad rail, yep. and I like that. Yeah, we call that our hybrid rail. I like so it. It's that M lock hybrid rail, the MHR. Yeah, this is this is a uh, this is nice. Yeah, this is this something I would run. This package comes out at nineteen ninety nine. Nineteen ninety nine, the whole thing. That is great. Obviously, not the laser uh, IR. It's probably not going to come with it, is it? No, that optics not going to come with it, guys. So when you hear this model, it's this base model, not with all of the add-ons and all of that. But uh, this is this is beautiful. This is really probably my favorite one on there. That DMR, that DMR is awesome as well. They're they're all great, but they all they're, the what I love is they're balanced. The weight's great. They feel good very very robust but yet it's not overwhelming with the weight so yeah. i love it and that's the whole point of this brand is being a very community driven brand so we we hear about what people have complaints about in different weapon yeah. systems and, and listen to them actually listen to them. Yeah. yeah yeah and so like when we decided to come out with this uh the suppressor line under radical firearms and we came out with our sensor suppressor great can great multi-caliber can it works great but one of the complaints was is that it kind of held you to our muzzle device well, with this brand, everything mm. is hub. That's right, that's awesome. John, for people out there that want to find out more about all the companies, all the products, tell us where they can find you on social media, websites, all that good stuff. So for our website is rdusa.com. Our Instagram is rd underscore underscore USA. You gotta love the underscore underscore. Yeah. Thanks, Instagram. <laughs> <laughs> But then there you'll be able to see all of our belt fed cans. You'll be able to see everything, all the testing we've done and all the work. And the cool thing about the cans, go back in case you missed it, 3D. 3D printed. 3D sure. printed. The technology will overtake the world, but it's kind of got some cool stuff too. So, John, thank you so much for coming on. Uh, we'll, coming uh, guys, go check out Radical. They've got some really great stuff. And uh, go check them out on social media. Tell them we sit in you and say hello. Until next time, guys, we'll see you soon. Semper Fi.